catch fish. What's up guys, it's Captain Robert Rubleski with Big League Charters. Um, today, me and Clark decided to go over to Lake Okeechobee and we did a little bit of fishing today. Um, we've had different weather. First thing in the morning, we had the sunny bright day. Um, the top water bite only lasted for about an hour. And once that happened, we went straight into punching. I'm a firm believer that when that sun's completely up, especially during the summertime or any, any time of the year, punching is the key. Um, Lake Okeechobee's been getting a lot of rain. Uh, the, water, the water levels are up over about 15, 15 and a half feet now. And these fish are spread out. They're hiding underneath heist and mats and stuff like that. And the punching bite is unreal. So I'm gonna go over a couple baits that I like using. Um, I'm with Bruiser Baits and I use these, uh, these intruders quite often and the reason why I use these intruders typically more than a thicker type of bait is because they're a little skinnier you get a better hook set on them uh, these are the type of colors I like throwing uh, I throw out this knockout color which is like a little bit of June bug in uh, black and blue a little green pumpkin black and blue June bug and this new color that I have no clue what it is but it's on fire right now normally when I'm punching mats <clears throat> the typical rig setup I like to throw like a 7-eleven heavy rod um, with about 50 to 65 pound braid and when I'm rigging up these um, these hooks and stuff like that I use two of these bobber stoppers um, the reason why I use two is because one eventually you'll end up breaking and then you're gonna have to retie every time especially when you're fishing tournaments the, you don't want to retie all the time you want to keep fishing and fishing and fishing and chugging along so I put two on there and I throw like an ounce and a quarter or an ounce and a half flat out tungsten weight and I uh, usually a three aught uh, monster flip eagle torcar hook is really my key bait. I'm going to show you a little, a couple little techniques and stuff like that that I like to use when I'm flipping. So, for instance, this little area right here that has a couple highs and mats, some cocktails. That's primarily like an area that I like to fish and, and focus and punch. When you're throwing this, you try not to make a big splash. Um, I think the bigger splash it ends up spooking these fish and they'll end up charging away. So slightly pitch in there. And I do a couple yo-yos here and there. Most, about 75% of the time these fish are reaction fish. So as soon as you punch it in, you're gonna get a bite right away. You'll know. But if, if the bite's really, really slow, especially when it's really, really hot or it's really, really cold and you're flipping and you're punching, you wanna go slower and slower and slower. Usually they don't react to it right away. You actually have to fish for them. So that's pretty much guys, that's it. Um, that's how I normally fish and how I punch fish here in Lake Okeechobee. Um, if you have any questions, just um, hit me up. Um, you can find, follow me on Instagram and on Facebook at Captain Rob Robleski. And I'll talk to you guys later.